So after like 24 hours of not knowing where this actually was, I finally have it. You know, long story short, I had to go actually go pick this up from the uh, courier's depot because you know trying to get it was just impossible. But you know, super happy to have it now. So let's just check it out. So in the past I was never really a big God of War fan, which is kind of what tempted me to buy this version of the game, like, you know, back then when they announced all the uh, collector's editions and whatnot, like, still wasn't sure about the game, so I definitely didn't want to pay that amount of money for a collector's edition of a game that I may have not liked. Plus, you know, it being such a big, big box with a, you know, massive statue, um, yeah, it tempted me to buy this version of it. But, um, you know, looking back at it now, kind of wish I did. Because, uh, you know, the game's apparently awesome. I have yet to try it. But, um, you know, everything you get in the collector's edition looks really awesome. But, uh, you know, maybe one day I might be able to pick it up really cheap. But I did get the limited edition version of the game. It comes in this beautiful box, like... Just nice, small, compact. Like, really like it. Let's uh, open her up. And she comes with the steelbook. Yeah. When I first saw it, I wasn't a huge fan, but definitely, you know, looking back at it now, it is very, it is very stylish. I'd love to know what this actually says. Um, yeah. Open her up. Watch what you think at first glance is an instruction manual. It's just like the bonus code for the game in like 15 different languages. Uh, a little bit disappointing. <laughs> But you know, pretty awesome still book. And you get God of War art book. Hopefully this doesn't spoil anything because I haven't, yeah, haven't played it yet. Uh, yeah. Some uh, awesome pictures of Kratos there. Beautiful environments. Where does that one look? I wonder if that's a location in the game. But yeah, like I I pre-ordered this from a JB Hi-Fi, and you know, not thinking about it, how it was going to get sent, I um, you know, it got sent yesterday through a courier company, and I sorry, it got sent on Thursday and it got delivered on Friday, but because I wasn't home, no one, uh, they couldn't just leave it there because it needed a signature. So, it got sent back to their, uh, their depot, which is like 50 kilometers away from here. And um, oh, it's so annoying, like, with no one being home, you know, because both of us work, it's just impossible to get anything. But, um, you know, Jess did some calling and whatnot, and she managed to find out where it actually was because the, um, the mail slip that you get for a Mr. Mr. Thing was just wasn't filled out at all, so we didn't know what to do. But uh, she got to the bottom of it, worked out that I could go pick it up. Luckily, I was working in the city at, at the time, so yeah, it wasn't too much of a drama to go and grab it. But um, yeah, you know, just just really glad that I've got it to play for the over the weekend. Yeah, lots of, uh, lots of really cool art. This is a really cool little art book. Some weapons there. But yeah, just hats off to uh, Santa Monica Studios for just making an epic game. Like, 